Howdy, this is Bubba. I am back. With, I got some good reception on the uh, top 10 small school quarterback video I did, so I'm going to do another one of that. Um, this will be about the running backs. I am a running back first guy. I always like running backs. So again, this will be similar. It will be um, small school running backs, so none of the Power 4 conferences, and they must be juniors or younger. So uh, I'm not going to do as many here. I got five plus one honorable men mention so uh in general i thought these were harder to find um it was a lot of speed backs not a lot of kind of power type backs but i was able to scrounge around and find some uh, i always try to get a little bit of everything that way it's not just all one type of back um, but going to the first or going to number five um you know, this guy's buried on the depth chart a little bit. He is a freshman, and he's actually the fifth string running back on UTSA. So it's University of Texas San Antonio, if you don't know, um, is Brandon High, so kind of a neat name. Um, he's uh, got some interesting traits. He's, uh, he's 215 pounds, so he's got good size. He's listed as elusive back, but he's got... He's got 94 speed, 93 Excel, 94 speed, 93 Excel, his, you know, high 80s for agility and change of direction. Um, so, you know, having that type of speed at 215 pounds in a freshman is is good he's a little bit limited on, on that, but, uh, you know, so he can do some kick returns. Um, it's not a... Let's see, but he's also um, one of these. He's got some decent, you know, break tackling trucking as well. Just to say his trucking on here does not. Let's go back to this other screen. I think it's like, so he's not, you know, with his 215, at 215 pounds, you know, 79 strength, 79 break tackles. 78 truck so you're going to be able to run inside or outside with him and again even though he's buried he is a freshman so you can give him some some carries looks like you got a pretty good starter here that's uh you know senior so you can split carries his freshman year and then have him take over sophomore year and then you know maybe get um four years out of him but so yeah, that's his. You know, that's his. His calling card is 94 speed at 215 pounds and being a freshman. Uh, the next guy is, if I was doing my personal rankings, he might be number one on my personal list. Um, he's got five physical traits, as you see. Um, and that is Elijah Davis, the starting running back for Louisiana. Uh, he's a freshman, so that's. You know, one reason why he's on here, but he's at 200, he's 5'9", 228, so got that bowling ball type shape. Um, but, um, but he's listed as elusive back despite being 228 pounds, so that kind of tells you where I'm going with this. Uh, 91 speed, 93 acceleration. Um, so his agility and change of direction, his agility is not that good. And it's change of direction is okay, but, um, you know, 91 speed, 93 acceleration at 228 pounds. I like that. And then if you go to the power category, you see he's got 85 trucking, 83 strength. You know, got the toughness and the injuries, stiff arm and all that stuff there. Um, so... Um, yeah, so I mean, you've got the kind of a little bit of the height, weight, speed type guy, and you know, as a freshman, he's you know, you're going to be able to um, get potentially four years out of at out of that. Um, so yeah, the and um, he's actually they've actually got a couple others while we're here. Um, they got a couple other juniors too that, and they got to change the pace back here. Um, so, yeah, that's uh, uh, Elijah Davis is number four. Number number three is the start running back for Bowling Green, Teron Stewart. Um, similar size to the last guy, 5'9", 225. This guy is older, being a junior. Um, 5'9", 
225. He's a power back, and he is top 10 in the country in um, trucking and breaking tackles for any position. So that's his that's his calling card. Um, got 92 break tackle, 94 trucking. He's got the carry the ball carry. But he's got some solid speed, 89 speed, 90 acceleration. You know, so for power back, that that's plenty. Um, you know, so yeah, kind of that's your in between the tackles. Just normal development. So you, know, you might not necessarily have the upside, but as you see, 86 overall, he's going to be able to. You're going to be able to build your offense around him right away, and that'll give you, you know, two years or so to, um, you know, build your team up. Um, you know, he's not going to fumble and that kind of stuff. But yeah, if you like the power back, that's. He's the way to go. And as you saw, the last guy had five mental abilities, the all five physical abilities. The other guys didn't have that much. This guy's got three, and that is uh, Junior Ismail Mahada, I guess. I'm not good at pronouncing names. Um, Texas State starting running back, 5'9", 180, impact development. So, um, you know, he should develop – you know, he's 89 overall, so he's, you know, he's got a high, high overall. So if you can get him to come back for senior year, you, you know, could look, could be looking at mid 90s. Um, he's a speed guy. Uh, 94 speed, 97 acceleration. He doesn't have the, he's got the break tackle at 90, but I don't think he's actually going to break many tackles because he doesn't have the strength or the trucking so you know even you know he's small at 180 pounds 5'9 with no strength and no trucking so despite the break tackle i wouldn't project him to break much but again as you see that he does have five five physical traits looks like so um, you know 91 agility change your direction spin move and that kind of stuff so He's going to be really good right away as, you know, if you end the more of the speed back, you know, shotgun type offenses. And this is a honorable mention. So this is for all my flex bone style offenses. Air Force, uh, which I played a game with this guy. He did really good. And they actually, actually one of the most fun playbooks I've had being Air Force. They got a lot of flex bones, a lot of five receiver sets. But anyway, he, this is the strongest fullback in the game and he's got the best break tackle and he's got speed to go along with it uh, pretty much maxed out you he kind of is what he is he's a junior so you can get two years out of him um, fullback does seem to be a pretty good position to recruit if you're running a dynasty with him so you know as you see um how big is he six foot two ten so he's not big so he's more of um, and he's more of a ball carrier than a blocker, but he, 83 speed, 88 agility. And for fullback, that's pretty good. We got the ball carrier vision. Um, but here's good things. They're, they don't show. 86 trucking. Go back to the other screen here. Uh, 83 speed, 88 agility, 89 break tackle, 90 trucking. Um, so for a fullback... You know, for a ball carrier and fullback, he's not really going to block for you. A 64 run block, so he's okay there. But, yeah, that's honorable mention for all my fullback fans. And the number one halfback on my list to build a dynasty around is a guy that is a uh, sophomore from Tulane. I do think they got some neat uniforms. Um, had a big year last year, apparently 90. Uh, he's a uh, Makai Hughes, 5'11", 205. He's got star development. I think Tulane does have some neat uniforms, if that makes you feel any better. But he has um, – he's – a little bit of a do-it-all guy, despite the smaller size. Well, 205 has got decent size. Uh, 91 speed, 93 acceleration, 91 agility, 90 change of direction, 91 juke move, 
Hey, you got this decent spin move, but then as you see the 94 brake tackle, so with the combination of speed and, and that, but I don't think he's got, I think he's got better strength than the other, so he's got decent strength at 72 overall. Um, we've got the, the trucking is 82, so you know you you're gonna be able to run inside or outside with him. He's got the, even got the 91 juke move can catch. So yeah, that's my number one Makai use from Tulane. He's also got the five physical uh, the five physical abilities here. Um, Shifty sidestep take over 360. So those are more of your shifty type out one outside type abilities. But yeah, that's it. That's my number one halfback to build your dynasty out of. If you're still watching, like and subscribe.